Scientists are calling it the worst damage to the Great Barrier Reef they've ever seen. Huge areas of coral are bleached white and will likely die from a deadly combination of natural and man-made conditions. It's prompting a desperate plea to do more to address the reef's biggest threat. This is the reef as we think we know it, and this is the reality right now. It was deeply shocking to, to get there and just find it uh, white. It's called coral bleaching, a result of warm ocean temperatures brought on by El Nino weather conditions and global warming. Bleached coral usually dies, which is a life sentence for fish and other organisms. Utterly upsetting. It's disturbing. This video was taken north of Cairns. We've already lost about 50% of the Great Barrier Reef coral cover in the last 27 years, and we seem to be seeing another 50% loss in that northern area. Some of the most popular sites for tourists have also been impacted by coral bleaching in recent weeks. Scientists predicted this year was a high risk for coral bleaching. There's very little they can do in the short term to stop it, but there are actions we can take to reduce its impact. So things like uh, land clearing, things like agricultural pollution. Measures the state government says it's already addressing through its 35-year reef management plan. The Environment Minister wants more help from the top. Deliver for Australia a decent plan to address climate change as well as additional support for our efforts to protect the Great Barrier Reef. Spending money to save a priceless natural wonder. Laura Dimmick, 7 News.